let's take a look at some of the coolest targets for BB guns, air guns, and airsoft guns. Let's go. All right, let's take a closer look. So as you can see here, some of these are DIY, but some of these are ones I've purchased. And let's take a look at what some of these can do. So some of these are for BB guns or airsoft, but some of them are for air guns. They require a little more power, such as this one here, to actually knock these back. It takes quite a bit of power. It's not gonna happen from just like a Daisy Red Rider um, or like an airsoft gun that's not gonna shoot really hard. Um, next up, you get the trusty balloon. Always a crowd pleaser to shoot balloons. Just get a little wooden stick, tape it on there. It's always fun. Next up, the cans. Always a good one. The cans always give you that good sound. Um, you get to rip them up pretty good. You can see it goes through them. And if you leave them full of soda, it is really awesome. Down here we have shatter blasts. So these uh, explode, they're like little clay uh, targets and they kind of shatter and explode when you shoot them. They're very fun as well. Um, let's move on to this one here. This is a spinner target. So if you hit these, it's gonna go back. Uh, it's not gonna go all the way around if you're using airsoft or BB guns again, but the air guns might put it back. But that's what I started with. You can tell this has got quite a bit of use. Next one, we have a dueling tree. This is definitely for air guns. This is pretty cool. You can hit the other side before the other person. We have these Humorex uh, traps. So hopefully they trap most of the BBs. A little tic-tac-toe game, which is more difficult than it seems. We have the Daisy rocket shot. And by the way, guys, I'll be shooting every single one of these things so you can kind of see uh, what they are like in action here. But the Daisy rocket shot will launch this can way up in the air. And let's see, oh, we got the big zombie. So the zombie, when I bought this, would bleed. And you can see inside kind of now, but it had these like biodegradable paintballs that if you shot them, they would bleed. And uh, it's still pretty cool. Even if it doesn't bleed anymore, I've torn this thing to shreds and it's a lot of fun. Um, I've saved kind of the last three as my favorites here. So you can see the spinner target here here and the double texas star here are absolutely my favorite so when you hit i'll just use this big one but when you hit one of these it starts moving a little bit you can tell it's pretty cool uh it definitely makes it a lot more challenging and a lot more fun but i like that they're just magnetic and you can just reset them pretty easy uh so let's get to shooting some of these guys all right let's shoot some of these targets so today We'll be using two PSM-45 BB pistols. I will be using a VSR-10 airsoft sniper rifle. And maybe a little bit of the classic Daisy Red Rider. So let me shoot some of these. I'm not gonna be far away. I just want you guys to be able to see the targets really well. Let's see what we got here. Let's go. All right, first up, let's do some dual pistol action here. Let's see. The Red Rider. Let's hit a little shatter blast in the front row. Ooh. Pretty cool. Let's hit a little crossman and plinker in the back there. Let's spin it. Little tic-tac-toe. A little tic-tac-toe. Oh, couldn't do it. Big spinner, big spinner. Hit the zombie for fun. Let's hit the rocket shot on the right. Pretty good. Let's finish up with the balloon. Woo, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Not too bad, hopefully you guys like that. If these videos help you at all, always appreciate the subs and the likes and the comments. See you guys next time.